Hi, I'm Nicholas again from Pigments Painting and uh, we're down to the fine tuning and whatnot. Um, I have most of the trim installed. The walls are not bad. Uh, I don't like to do a lot of caulking. Um, it should be very little bit of caulking. You know, just a bead all the way around. Prime and then maybe one more bead all the way around. But, um, this particular area, it was a transition from the old to the new. Had a slight hump, so the trim didn't fit exactly the way I wanted it to. So I had to spend just a little bit of time and uh, I installed the trim and uh, the gap was just a bit too much for me to do what I needed to do with caulking. Um, like I said, you don't want to do a lot of caulking. I want to make sure that everything is square and perfect. I mean, I should have done this before, but uh, clients were in a rush and so was I actually, but, um, and this is what happens. So I skimmed out the um, areas that weren't perfect. And as you can tell, the trim now fits perfectly all the way around. And when this is all dry, I'm going to have to do very little caulking. Just a bead all the way around and top and bottom. And that's, that's pretty much it. So the joints work out very well. You know, it's just one extra step. But I also have to go through all the walls and fine tune, make sure there's no imperfections on these walls. Like this wall here was never really prepped. I mean, it was sanded and just quickly skimmed out. Um, and then I have issues. This is an old transition door. Um, the inlay was done squarely. That is square. But as you can see, the wall is not. So I have to build that out. I'm gonna, I mean, it's, it doesn't seem to bother them, but it bothers me. So, and since I'm going to put my name on this job, it's got to be perfect. All right. So that's going to be fixed. Um, means I got to pull the frame out a little bit. This is going to be all uh, new trims going to put on here. And the issue is that the trim is four and a half inches wide. So it's going to be, but it's going to be uh, miter sawed all the way down and joined like a picture frame. Uh, it's going to be beautiful. Crown molding still has to go up there. It's just a couple of pieces and uh, all this gets replaced. So it's ugly. I didn't need to fix it. But this is not square. I have to fix that. So the only thing I have to do now is finish the trim up. Um, I don't rush this kind of stuff because it has to be perfect. I can't do not perfect. And we decided this railing is going to go with mahogany. Instead of re replacing it, um, we're going to match the uh, floor color to the top and possibly paint the uh, <coughs> The, uh, these things are white, give it a nice, fresh, clean, modern, updated look without spending a fortune. Um, we're way below budget, which is nice. And uh, these are great clients, so I don't mind doing extra for these people. All right. Um, like I said, I'm doing their entire house. I've done all the bathrooms, uh, two bedrooms, and uh, they came out beautifully. And they're extremely happy. So am I. So. This is Nicholas from Pigments Painting. I am working late Saturday night, and uh, I'm going to be working Sunday and until the job is done. So I always finish on time. Hi. Take care. Have a wonderful weekend. Bye.